Oh. <laughs> the golden Loxley Robin Model 1 darts review begins right now. Oh, almost all three. What's up guys, Worldwide here. We've got an incredible video for you today. I can't wait to share these things with you. Now, as some of you guys might be aware, I mentioned it in previous videos, I'm on vacation right now. I'm probably, as you're watching this video, I'm probably up in Maine enjoying a nice lobster roll or two or three. However, I recorded this video sometime last week. YouTube algorithms kill you if you don't upload videos on a consistent basis. So I didn't want the channel to fade off into the shadows. You're probably watching this video on a Monday, March 20th, I guess that's gonna be the release date. And like I said, wow, wait till you see these things. So in this video, I'll be reviewing the Loxley Robin Model 1 Golden Edition darts. And I tell you what, right now, I like these even more than the natural tungsten version that they released when the company first came out. These are just, wow, some other level. And as you probably saw in the thumbnail, perfect match weight as well. I mean, come on, it doesn't get too much better than that. So. I picked these up at, where'd I get them? Dart Shopper. They come in 22 and 24 grams. Now, the reason I like Dart Shopper is they're shipping to the United States. I ordered these on the weekend and I had them in my hand probably on a Tuesday or Wednesday afternoon. So yeah, like two, three, four days at the maximum shipping. Super quick shipping. So I'm gonna have the link to Dart Shopper down below. You can check out these uh, Golden Loxley Robin Edition or any of the other Loxley darts that you want to. So yeah, again, that link down in the pinned comment. So what do you say we just hop right into it? Stats and dimensions, it's got a special video clip for the perfect match weight, that was amazing. After that, we'll get them on the board. I'll throw these for a bit and I'm gonna let you know what I think of the golden Loxley Robin Model 1s. Here we go, guys. Okay, guys, wait till you see how awesome these things are. Close up, beautiful set of darts, although highly unusual as well. So we'll start with the packaging. We've got your classic compact cardboard hang case from Loxley. Inside, we had the foam insert that held the darts, but let's get right to these things. Look at that beautiful gold-coated barrel. I guess, you know what, the only negative I could think of is some people might confuse these for brass darts, but as you know, 90% tungsten with a golden titanium-coated barrel. I mean, those things, even nicer in person. You're gonna have to trust me on that one, but yeah, these things are absolutely beautiful in my hand. They do come with an intermediate, yeah, I guess I would call it an intermediate length, Loxley nylon stem, 41 millimeters, not including the threads. So there's the stems. And again, these absolutely unreal Loxley standard size flights. You've got the gold embossed Loxley logo. And look, look at the detail of these things. Yeah, nicest black flights on the market, in my opinion. But yeah, there's the darts. There's the packaging. But what do you say we get a little closer look and I'll run down all the stats and dimensions I can think of. And the perfect match weight. Okay, there you go. Nice look at the barrels there. I mean, come on, I'm almost at a loss for words how much I love the looks of these darts. The, the golden barrel, the black contrast on the front and the back. Wow, just, um, yeah, almost at a loss for words, really, how much I like these darts. But we're going to start up front. These come with a 32 millimeter black coated point of which 28 millimeters is sticking out of the front of the barrel. Now the barrels themselves, like I just said, 90% tungsten. The barrel length coming in rather long at 55 millimeters. In the barrel width right at the top of this arrow shaped nose cone 7.7 millimeters wide on my digital calipers now i unscrewed the stem checked out the drill depth of the barrel these are the most shallow barrels i've ever reviewed they're drilled out only 8.2 millimeters deep in the back end so um yeah that's about as shallow as it gets to be honest with you now ready for the match weight guys the match weight was so awesome perfect match weight it had to get its own video clip so let's roll into that and take a look at the weight Okay, guys, you know when the scale makes an appearance here on this channel, it's going to be a big deal, and rightfully so. However, I do want to say this, and I've said this in other review videos, dart reviewers, myself included, I'm not leaving myself out, we make way too big a deal about match weighting. We're dart players. We don't have superhuman touch. You can't detect a minimal weight difference of hundreds of a gram, even tenths of a gram. However, when you get perfect match weighting, I mean, that should be celebrated as well. So, I mean... I'm not trying to make a big deal about this. However, when you get something perfect, perfect like this, I think it's amazing. So 24 grams, you saw that. Again, 24 grams, probably no surprise. I'm sure I've got it in the thumbnail 
and in the title. And finally, the third barrel, come on, you know what was gonna happen, 24 grams, and these scales are so, so sensitive. That's just amazing, guys. Even if this is a basic barrel with not much machining, I mean, you still have to get everything absolutely spot on perfect, even the points. I mean, I don't know who makes the points, I don't think Loxley does, but just everything has to be perfect. That is some amazing quality control from Loxley. Well done, guys. That is awesome. And hey, what's these green flights doing in there? But let me tell you about the grip on these barrels. Okay, guys, you got to admit that last clip was something special. Nowadays, we do see perfect match weight on several sets of darts. However, for it to line up perfectly with the advertised weight, that's something that's just exceedingly rare. And uh, again, well done, Loxley. That was awesome. So looking at the barrels, I mean, come on. About as basic as it gets with the exception of this arrowhead shaped front end. And you know what? This ridge right here, it makes for a perfect marker. So if I was to throw these darts, that would probably be my grip. So point of finger and thumb right on this ridge. And it just makes for a repeatable grip each and every time. Now, as far as the back end here, we got the Loxley logo right there in the back of the barrel. Now, as far as the grip rating, you know what? I thought about this with it being a smooth barrel dart with the exception of this ridge right here, I'm not gonna give these things a rating because I think the grip level is gonna vary from person to person. Like I said, smooth barrel, so obviously not that grippy. However, I will say this golden titanium coating, it adds um, a little warmth to the barrel when you touch it. So I think it feels a little warmer than a natural tungsten barrel, although it doesn't add to the grip level, if that makes sense. So, I mean, this could be anywhere from a one to maybe a two and a half level grip, depending on where you grip it. Like I said, I'm gonna be on this ridge so that's going to add to the grip level. So yeah, it again, it all comes down to the to where you grip. If for some reason you're a front gripper, you're going to be completely smooth. Or if you're a rear gripper, it's going to be completely smooth. So yeah, I'm going to pass on the grip level rating. It's going to depend person to person. Now the front end here, let's see. Yeah, we got a little bit of a lip right here. And you know what? If I was going to use these for any extended length of time, I would definitely repoint them. Matter of fact, I have a brand new set of Target Golden Target Storm points right there, and I really thought about repointing them for this video. I'm gonna give it a pass, but I would highly recommend you do repoint these, and they look absolutely amazing when you have that perfect transition from point to barrel. So yeah, a repointing, highly recommended. But other than that, I'm gonna throw them just like you see them here. I may add the Trident 180 nose cones just for the throwing part of the video, but I will be throwing them with the Loxley stems and flights. So uh, let's get them on the board. And I have no doubt they're going to throw well. I had a great time with the Loxley, the original Loxley Model 1s, the natural tungsten version. So, yeah, these are going to throw equally as well. So can't wait to throw them. Here we go. Okay, guys, ready for this? Just had a quick warm-up. The darts are flying amazingly well. I'm having a blast throwing these. And it takes me right back to the first review I did on the natural tungsten Loxley Robins. And I think I'm pretty much going to say the same thing in this video as I did in that video. I tell you what, though, you look at this barrel and you're like, you look at the dimensions, the 55 millimeter length, and you're like, I'm not going to be able to throw those too well, right? Trust me on this one. These barrels throw much better than you ever imagined. It's just such an easy barrel to throw. Again, with this arrowhead shape on the front, my fingers are right behind that arrowhead. And it's almost like you're just pushing the dart. Hard to explain, but yeah, it's just very easy to throw, repeatable grip every time. So we'll see how this goes. Uh, nothing fancy tonight. I'm not going to do checkouts. I'm not even going to run an average. Just a couple quick throws. All that, and you watch. I'll chuck one right into the five. Whew, thank God. Oh, there we go. Ooh, that's a tight 140. Now that second dart the flight kind of kicked over to the right a little bit. So I am seeing some fishtailing a little bit. I think, you know, I think these stems might, for me anyway, they might be a little bit too long considering the barrel is, again, 55 millimeters, but you just have to experiment around with different stems and flights, maybe different points. Once you get these barrels dialed in to your throw, wow, they honestly throw incredibly well. That one was straight, a little bit low, a little bit low. Try to get the third one up a bit. Tight group anyway. And I think that I, I said that about the first, the natural tungsten version. You get a specialty point on here. 
you're going to be shocked at how tightly you can group these darts. Get out of that five. Now see that again, that went in the, it went in the 60, but the flight kicked to the right. So yeah, I see a little bit of fishtailing here. As long as they hit the target, I don't really care, but I do prefer my darts to go straight into the board. And like I said, I'm using the, the stock setup, so I didn't bother to change much. Uh-oh, I'm going to have to use a different flight. <laughs> they good 140, though, but that flight went flying. I must have another set of Loxleys around here. Aha, the brass ones. I think those are model two. I think they're still in the World Championship. That other flight went way behind my desk. I'm not even going to bother to try to retrieve that one. Hey, we're good to go. What was that? Three throws? That was almost a 180 right there. They get to the board really quick as well. Or at least it seems like they do. Whew, all right. We'll do this last throw right at the bullseye. But yeah, honestly, just one of those barrels that surprisingly throws incredibly well. Feels nice off the fingertips. Love the gold coating. They feel a little bit warmer to the touch. What's not to like, right? Perfect match weighting as well. Whew. I think Loxley got everything right. So right at the bullseye. That's perfect placement right in the bottom. Ah, oh, just a bit right. Again, with these flights popping off. 225s in a bowl, we'll take it. So hey, wow. As you saw there, I mean, that was five, was that five turns? Five pretty decent turns. They throw well. Every, every great thing I said about these in the first video, I'm saying it again now. These are just a surprisingly pleasant dart to throw. They really are. So um, check this out. Obviously, we got the 180 clip coming. I'm going to ramble on a little bit after that about the rating. And then we have a bonus clip for you at the end. I thought it was pretty funny. So stick around for that and hope you enjoyed this clip. There it is. Boom! Get in there. Nice tight last dart, by the way. And there it is. Those nose cones on the front end just goes to show you how tightly you can group these darts. So um, great place to end the video, guys. I hope you enjoyed the review of the Loxley Robin Model 1 Golden Edition darts. If you did enjoy the video, thumbs up. Always appreciated. And a reminder, link to Dart Shopper down below in the pinned comment. But hold on, guys. We have an outro or an outtake here right after this wrap-up that I'm just about to give these darts. So normally, this time of the video, I give these a recommendation on how well I think they're going to work for a recreational dart player. Let's be honest here. As much as I enjoyed throwing these things, as much as I like these darts, they're unusual, right? They're a little bit long, weird shape, smooth barrel. So I honestly don't think they're gonna work for your average everyday recreational player. So we're just gonna skip that rating entirely. And we're gonna go in this direction. We're gonna talk about, should you get these darts to put them in the collection? Is it that good of a dart? Absolutely. If you missed out on the Loxley Natural Tungsten, the Robin Ones, the natural version, don't miss out on these ones. Don't sleep on this set of darts. I mean, it's such an unusual shaped dart, such a great dart to throw. 9.5 out of 10, you have to put them in the collection. That's just, it's how incredible I think they are. And again, one of those darts that are way easier to throw than you could ever imagine. So we'll just leave it at that. But now we have an outtake. I'm going to do my best to recreate Robin Hood. So um, I thought it was kind of funny. We'll throw that in the end. Hope you enjoyed the video. And until next time, guys, we'll see you on the next one. Later.
Loxley a Robin Hood, right? There's a Robin Hood. <laughs> Ooh. Robin Hood. <laughs> Ouch, look at that. Why you think they call me Mr. Worldwide? Let's show them why they call me.